simple question. Okay, if we were to play a game where you had to decide what we would do in a made-up fantasy dilemma in order to win some cash, would you want to play? Yeah! Okay then, let's make that hypothetical a reality. This is yes or no. Get that down. Tell us how this works. Okay, before the show, we surveyed our gorgeous audience out here. Hey! <laughs> With a few moral dilemma questions to see how they'd respond in some fantasy scenarios. I'll reveal the poll results for each yes or no answer. Then a lucky contestant will get the opportunity to guess whether or not one of my lovely co-hosts responded yes or no as well. If they're right, they'll get the dough. And $100 is theirs the key. <laughs> If they're wrong, they'll be taking home a priceless T-shirt from Maria. It's Steve. Okay. Who wants to play? First up from Rancho Cucamonga, California, Savaria Sanders. Where are you? Hey, girl. Hey. How you doing today? I'm great. How are you? Are you ready to get that dough? Get that dough. Yeah. Do this, girl. All right. all right. The first question we asked you all was: You find a suitcase with a five million dollars inside and a note that says "Donate me." Would you keep the money? Okay. Forty-three percent of y'all said yes. You would definitely <laughs> keep it. Ooh, look at y'all. Y'all real. And fifty-seven percent of you said no. You donate it, like the note instructed. Okay. Wow. Let me ask you some more. Yeah. What do you think Adrian would say? Would she say yes to keeping it or no, she would donate it? Audience, help her out. What do you think? <laughs> said no? All right. What do you think Adrian said, yes or no? No. <laughs> Is she right? Go! Oh! <laughs> you guys wrong. Adrian, tell us why you said yes. Okay. Yes, I would keep some of it, <laughs> but I would still donate the majority of it. Okay. It's so generous. So, 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 well, she threw you I'm for a, a loop, but exactly. you still get a priceless real T-shirt. Yes, you do. Oh. There you go. Thank you for playing. All right. Who else wants to play? Her? Who else? Oh. Up next from Compton, California, is Blanca Flamenco. Yes okay. or no, do you think you can do this? Um, I can definitely do this. All right. I got it, I got it. We got you. Yeah. Here's our next question. We asked you beautiful people was, a famous artist makes a sculpture of you. It took them five years to make, but looks nothing like you. <laughs> Would you say something to the artist? 48% of y'all said yes, I'm telling you, boo, I'm mad. That don't look I like know. me. But. 52% of you said no, you wouldn't fess up that it didn't look like you. Okay, so Blanca, do you think Dr. Drew would say yes or no? Audience, help us out. You think Dr. Drew would say, tell the artist? Or what? You think he'd say yes? You think he No. Look at his face. What do you think? You think he would say yes or no? Um, I think he would say no. I think he's, uh, he'll be afraid like to hurt their feelings or something. It's been five years that they're working on it. Okay. So, it's it's very know. true. I'd be very afraid to hurt their feelings, but I would blame myself for being unable to appreciate a great piece of art. My kind of man. Oh, my God. <laughs> you were really, how would you tell him? I would send you in. Uh. Uh. Priceless t shirt, though. Yeah, that's a priceless clean t shirt. There you go. Thank you for playing, Blanca.